Hey, welcome to the Ginger Vintner. Chill reviews for chill people. So today I just wanted to quickly go over the canting, why we do it and how we do it. So most wines can actually be decanted and can benefit from decanting. Um, even champagnes can benefit from decanting. Um, and all decanting does is it opens up a tight wine. So a wine that needs to age a little bit more or a wine that's expressing too much of one fruit or might have um, a minor flaw that has developed over time, you can throw it in a decanter and it will act like giving it a little more age on it and kind of balance out those rough edges. So we've chosen a uh, 2014, so something with a little bit of age from Gilo Brew here. And um, I'm gonna show you how to decant it here. So um, we got our beautiful big decanter and this really helps. Um, the different size of your decanter does um, promote different types of oxygen within the wine. So um, a bigger decanter like this with more surface area will help you decant a little bit better. And what you want to do is you want to get as much surface area of wine throughout the glass. So I'll set it down here so we can see. I'm going to pour it to the opposite side of the decanter. See how it's hitting the decanter? And it's, see, you don't even hear the wine hitting itself because it's falling along the side of the decanter. Look how beautiful that looks. And you just kind of want to pour it slowly, you know? You don't want to hear glugging or or the wine dropping on itself, just kind of pour it at a steady rate. Um, and it looks really, really neat. So there you go. And also if you're worried about the wine with a little sediment, you can pour it through a cheesecloth or a um, tea sieve. So that's how you decant. And then you can even pick it up like this and just really gentle, give it a couple gentle swirls to kind of help promote the air through it. I mean, you can also leave it for wines that need a little bit more decanting. For something like a Pinot Noir or something light, I would recommend going ahead and drinking it now. Something a little bit bigger, maybe a Bordeaux or something that needs to age a little bit more, like a Chateau Neuf du Pop or a Barolo, you could leave it in the decanter for an hour or so and give it some time to open up. So that's how you decant. So you can subscribe to more videos um, here or um, follow us at Ginger Vintner. We'll see you when we taste this wine.